guys how you doing hope you are fine hope you are good welcome to my channel if this is your first time of watching any of my videos don't forget to click that subscribe button down below i post videos every sundays and yeah welcome in today's video i'm going to share with you guys 10 random facts about me this is for all my new subscribers and for my old subscribers as well but mainly for my new subscribers but yeah so you guys will get to know 10 random facts about me and yeah so let's get it 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 hey. <laughs> so yeah i'm just going to use my phone because i wrote it down because i'm very forgetful like very 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 forgetful so number one thing right i'm very emotional like the smallest thing makes me cry the tiniest thing make me cry like i can see a dog walking on the road and uh, the dog doing random things and things and i'll just be like oh, that dog is so cute oh my god and i'll start crying or i can see a baby and be holding a baby and just be like oh, the baby is so cute oh my god i'm very emotional i'm that girl in the cinema that will start crying because of one love love movie but yes i'm very very emotional the smallest things make me cry and i think it's because i'm a capricorn we capricorns were very emotional we have a very soft soft heart capricorns yeah very very soft heart we're very emotional but i'm a cow i'm a proud capricornian if that makes sense <laughs> i'm a proud capricorn yes so second thing about me i hate it on my skin guys don't understand hair on my skin makes my skin crawl i literally can't that's why most times i always have like short hair or i always pack my hair up or something i can't have hair on my skin it's just i'm grateful i'm grateful that i have short hair my natural hair is short because I can't imagine it being long and no. It's just hair on my back, hair on my skin makes my skin crawl. I can't stand it. I literally can't stand it. Ugh. Even talking about it, already, like I'm already getting itchy. No, I can't. Even though sometimes I do have my hair down, but I can't leave it down for long. I have to pack it up because after a while, like my body starts itching me so i can't so yes i hate hair on my skin i just nah, i can't the third thing about me i can't swim and this is the reason why if you haven't watched my story time the time of when i ne nearly drowned then i'll leave the video uh like uh, yeah, the video thingy here on the screen here somewhere but yeah but i can't swim and i don't think I'll be able to swim because I have fear I have the fear of swimming so yeah so I can't swim and I don't think I'll be learning how to swim anytime soon the fourth thing about me putting on makeup is a long thing for me like all this all this you see on my face it took me a good 15 minutes to decide if I want to come on YouTube wearing makeup or not and that's how it is every time like every time I have to go to an event and I have to wear makeup I think to my like it takes me like a good 20 15 minutes to decide if I want to put on makeup or not it's a it's a struggle like a proper struggle I'm just like really really do you want to wear makeup like do you have to wear makeup like can you not just go out like this I know makeup is good it makes you look more decent and it makes you look a bit obviously more mature and all that but for me putting on makeup is a big effort like a major 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 effort but when I do like when I do end up putting it on i'm like yes girl yes yeah selfie selfie everywhere yeah selfie mm, mm, yes <laughs> like i take loads of selfies but before before i put on makeup i'm like makeup really do i have to <laughs> so yeah putting on makeup for me is a big 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 effort um 15 about me a talking on the phone i prefer texting i'm a texter not a caller i just don't see why we have to sit on the phone for ages and talk like what are we talking about on the phone please what are we talking about on the phone it's just gonna get awkward after a while because there'll be nothing to to say you know when you're texting someone you can 
you just you guys are texting 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 after a while you just be like if you're tired of texting you 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 just on suddenly the person would know because you'd be like all right okay anyways i have to go i'll talk to you later blah blah text gone bye you know but on the phone like you just you, after a while you start talking nonsense on the phone because you have nothing else to say so you have to end up making up something to say on the phone that's well that's personally that's how i feel anyways but yeah i'm a texter not a caller i just don't see why i have to sit on the phone to talk when i can just text you just easier and texting is a lot cheaper nowadays you have whatsapp you have um i don't know you have you can even text on social media now you can text on snapchat now texting is a lot cheaper nowadays once you have it you have wi-fi it's a lot easier so calling is just effort just effort no the sixth thing about me i want to be a talk show host like i want to like do something like when the william or moments with mo or something like that you know so yeah so hopefully one day i'll be on a major or i'll be on a major talk show you know voicing my opinion something like the real or moments with mo or maybe one day something like wendy william because you guys know i love celebrity Yes, you know, my ultimate dream job is to be a TV host, either have my own or be on someone else's thing. So, fingers crossed. Yes, yeah, so the seventh thing about me, I procrastinate a lot. And guys, this is actually a problem. Like, it, it, it requires prayer. I'm telling you, start it requires prayer. I procrastinate a lot, and it's so bad. Like, when I'm supposed to do something, I don't do it right away. I leave it till like the last, last, last minute. Like the last, last, last second. Like it's really, really bad. Like proper bad. Like I procrastinate a lot. And it's not even, it's not even laziness. It's not about being lazy. It's just me like giving myself more time. Like if I'm supposed to do something, if I'm supposed to have something done by 4 o'clock, I'll wait until like half 3 or even quarter to four to do that thing and then i'll start rushing it's really bad like really 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 bad so yeah the seventh thing about me i procrastinate a lot you guys need to pray for me like you guys need to pray it's it's really deep very very deep the eighth thing about me i have a plane phobia like i hate airplanes like i literally hate it i'm sure you, you guys have seen my nigeria video when um i went to nigeria last year and i was on the plane i swear down guys i literally thought the plane was about to like fall down like off just fall down and crash if i can take a bus to another country far away i will if i can take the train to another country far away i will but plane i think that's why i don't travel a lot that's why because because i know i have I, I love to get on a plane to go to another country and uh, i just have a fear of planes i just nah i like i'm so scared that one day like i'll be on the plane and the plane will crash and that'll be the end of it like literally like that's that's a fear of mine and it's not I, it's not a good thing but yeah i'm just nah i i i'm scared of being on the plane i just can't the night thing about me i am always late <laughs> this is not a good thing but it's something that i've noticed over the years i'm always late even if i get even if i start getting them ready two hours before i'm still late like i'm always late like i have to be late i don't understand why i think it's a it's a nigerian thing or it's an african thing because nigerians or africans especially mostly nigerians were always late everywhere were always late to an event to anything to funerals to graduations to weddings were always late so i think that's that's why but that's not an excuse but yeah i'm always late that's bad very very bad but yeah i'm always late so bad but yeah that's the nice thing about me the number 10 thing about me um journal journaling is life i enjoy writing i write a lot i prefer to write put pen to paper instead of writing on my phone like yes i use i do use my phone when i get like when i, f I have that thoughts in my head and i don't have pa paper i write on my phone but journaling is life i write literally write down everything i do have a blog which 
obviously I don't update as often as I should but I do have a blog and I started writing a while back but then I stopped because I I don't know why but anyways yeah so journaling is life I literally journal everything I think I have about four different journals not now but built like that I've built over the over the years like even though I don't complete it I do have journals and I have one for this year as well which I'm nearly done with and then 2017 but yeah journaling is life I enjoy writing my thoughts everything going on in my head I enjoy writing it down so and i suggest maybe you guys should do that to, to try journaling it just it relaxes your mind relaxes it relaxes your body just everything you have if you have everything stored in your head it can lead to other it can just you, you can build up so much thoughts in your head and if you don't write it down that's what creates some create some sort of anxiety some sort of depression or it's just having lots of things in your head is not good so i just believe in journaling everything down once you write it down you're like it's it's out of your it's out of your head it's on paper now and then it's something you can now look back like like two years like two years later or one year later you can now look back and be like oh, okay so this is this was how i was feeling like a year before this this is how i was feeling before this is how i'm feeling now I definitely recommend journaling it's definitely definitely a must see that's 10 random things about me hope you guys enjoyed this video and yeah let me know i, I want to communicate with you guys you know let me know down below if you enjoyed this video let me know down below 10 random things about you if you're watching this video it doesn't even have to be 10 things it can just be one or two things random things about you if you're watching this video so yeah so leave a comment below i want to know random things about you about you guys actually leave a comment down below let me know random things about you guys and um, yeah don't forget to subscribe like and share this video and did i say leave a comment yet yeah, leave a comment down below let me know what else you want to see on my channel oh and follow all my social media links down below yeah and i'll see you guys in my next week bye